what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? David Banner is being accused of killing a man as a result of a car accident he was in about nine months ago where he suffered a concussion. Now, the sister of the deceased man is taken to social media to address the incident. While she doesn't outright blame David for her brother's death, she's upset that he hasn't reached out and apologized. Here's what she wrote on Instagram. There's a few grammatical errors, but we'll power through them. My brother did 10 years in prison and came to better his life and take care of his sons. Three months after he came home, he was in a fatal car accident. David Banner was the driver of the other car. He's complaining that he still has a concussion. But what about my brother who lost his life? What about his sons who had to grow up without a father? What about the pain we have to deal with on a daily basis, waking up and realizing he's really gone and it wasn't just a bad dream. And not to mention, David Banner, you knew my brother was dead on the scene and you didn't try to reach out to us and apologize or anything. It's been almost nine months and still no apology or none. How could you sleep knowing you killed someone and didn't do anything about it but get it covered up. Hashtag LLJ, justice for Jeremy. And also added the shade room. Okay. This is what this sounds like to me and I'm not trying to be insensitive myself, family, but one of the first things that an attorney will tell you if you get in a car accident to don't talk to the other party. The insurance company will tell you straight up, don't admit guilt, even if you are. Look on the back of your insurance card, if you have it nearby, or the next time you get in your car. Look on the back of that insurance card It'll tell you clear as day, do not admit guilt. The thing is, if David is not responsible for her brother's death, why is he apologizing? I can see maybe showing some empathy for loss of life, but apologizing? The sister says that she's upset that David talks about his concussion. You know, at, seemingly like it's a big deal and her, the way she's looking at it. She's like, you know, we lost a brother. We can never get back. And he's you know, on here on social media complain, complaining about a concussion. How do y'all see that, fam? Uh, I don't know if I'm being insensitive. I'm, I don't think I'm being insensitive. I think I'm just being, I think I would have done the same thing. And had it happened to me, you know, had the shoe been on the other foot, I don't see if, if the other person is not responsible, then I don't see why they should be apologizing. You know, I don't understand that. Like if you're not, guilty of something, why are you apologizing for that something? It doesn't make a lot of sense to me. And again, not trying to be insensitive to the family because I know that's got to be hard, but it just seems like to me that, you know, maybe, you know, the sister wants some attention, you know? I don't know what y'all think. Drop comment, fam. No more talk. What the mate is talking about. Yeah.